All right, number four, we want to write this one using interval notation and graph it, just like the others. Okay, so we have rational expressions this time, fractions. Two-thirds x plus six is less than or equal to negative two-thirds x plus two. Okay, so anytime I see fractions, I know we can get rid of them by multiplying. Looking on both sides, the only uh, number on the bottom we have is 3. So 3 is going to be the number we need to multiply by to get rid of uh, the fraction. So we can always do that. I'm going to multiply everything by 3. So both sides means I'm distributing 3. So multiply by 3. This gets multiplied by 3. Uh, this gets multiplied by 3. And so does this. Everything gets multiplied. When we multiply, um, actually with the fraction, we're dividing out the 3. So that goes away. We're left with 2x. Uh, 6 times 3 gives us 18. This is less than or equal to. Um, here again with the fraction, the 3 is going to cancel out our multiplication by 3. It's going to leave us with the negative 2x. And then 2 times 3 will give us 6. Okay, to get the variable on the left, um, I want to add the 2x to both sides. This will cancel. Combine these, we get 4x, bring down our positive 18. This is less than or equal to positive 6. We're now going to subtract 18 from both sides. And then I bring down 4x, and this is less than or equal to negative 12. And then final step to get x by itself is to divide by 4, and we'll divide on both sides. Now this time when we divide, we don't have to flip because we're not dividing by negative. Only when we divide or multiply by negative. So this will become x because 4 divided by 4 is 1, still less than or equal to and negative 12 divided by 4 is negative 3. So here's the solution. If we <clears throat> do it in interval notation, so this arrow is pointing us to the left, so that means we're going all the way to negative infinity and coming up to negative 3, and it will be a bracket. And if we did this on a number line, here's 0, negative 3 will be over here somewhere. We do a bracket and shade that way. Okay, so interval notation first. Get the keypad. We're going to do a half open. So I want the close on the right side. Negative infinity up to negative 3. And then when we graph it, so I've kind of drawn it out here. Same thing, half open, bring the right side to negative 3, and the left side is going to go all the way to infinity, negative infinity. 